Hello, today I'm going to show you how to draw this snowflake. Let's make a new document, go to File, New and set the profile to Web. Now let's get rid of the stroke and change the fill to Blue. First we'll create a background. Select the Rectangle tool and draw a rectangle across the whole artboard. You can leave it as it is or if you like you can add a gradient to it. Now lock this layer and let's make a new layer. Next we will add guidelines to help us with our drawing. Press the Ctrl and R buttons on your keyboard to show the ruler. Now click on this corner, hold and pressing down the Ctrl key move your mouse to the center of the artboard. Then release the mouse. Next we will draw a six point star. To do that select the star tool, click on this intersection and start dragging out the star. Before you let go of your star first press the up arrow key one time to add one extra point to the star and then press the shift key to constrain it. Now stretch the star to about this size, release the mouse and then release the shift key. Let's change the color of this star to light blue. Next we will offset this star three times and make three additional copies. To do that go to object, path and offset path. Set the offset to 15 and click OK. Let's change the color of this star to pink and repeat this process two more times. Go to Object, Path, Offset Path, leave the offset as it is and change the color. And let's do it one more time. Next we will cut out the blue and the green shapes. To do that go to the Selection tool, now select the blue star and holding down the Shift key select the pink star. Next open the Pathfinder panel. If you don't have it open go to Window and select Pathfinder and choose Minus Front. Now select the green and the yellow star and do the same. Let's select everything and change the color of these stars to white. And let's rotate it. Press the letter R for the Rotate tool, press Enter and type 30 for the angle. Click OK. Next we'll add six branches to form a snowflake. Let's zoom in on the top part. Select the pen tool. Now click somewhere here and draw one side of the first branch. You can design any shape you like. And finish the path. Now using the direct selection tool you can modify individual points until you are happy with your shape. Next we'll reflect this half branch to the other side. To do that select the branch then press the letter O for the reflect tool and holding down the ALT key click on this anchor point to set the reflection point. Choose the vertical axis and click copy. Now select both parts, go to Pathfinder and choose Unite. Next we will rotate this part and make additional copies. First select the branch, now press the letter R for the Rotate tool and holding down the ALT key click on this intersection to set the rotation point. Type 60 for the angle and click copy and then press Ctrl D to make more copies. And finally select everything, go to Pathfinder and choose Unite. Now go to Object, select Group and turn off the guidelines. Thanks for watching, bye bye.